Howdy! Welcome to our world in naturopathy, allopathy number 4, part 4. This is the last part of number 4 of this series of organs care. Part 1 of number 4 featured on brain care, while part 2 was on heart and thyroid care. Part 3 of number 4, the video prior to this one, was about stomach care. This last part, 4, the topic is on kidney and bladder care. Usually, a human body has two kidneys. They are situated on the left and right side of the spine near the waist area towards the back. Kidneys function as blood filters, removing toxins from the blood and transforming them into waste and urine. Kidneys also balances the minerals in the blood that promotes strong and healthy bones. Kidneys regulate the blood pressure and releases hormones that help the bones to be strong and healthy. The waste excreted from kidneys turn into urine, which will then be stored in the bladder. Bladder is situated behind the pelvic bone. It is a part of the urinary system. Bladder, a muscle, functions as a urine store releasing the urine through the urethral sphincter, which dilates and contracts. If the urinary system is not in the proper working order, symptoms such as disrupted cycles in urination, in example, urinating more often, or experiencing discomfort during the act, having problems with concentration, sleeping disorders, eye puffiness, which are bags under the eyes, lack of appetite, swelling of the feet and or ankles, muscle cramps, and possible skin problems. To avoid all these problems, it is best to keep the kidneys and bladder clean and healthy. Practicing these simple steps can help do that. 1. Drink spiced milk 3 to 4 times a week. Recipe for spiced milk is in video number 1. 2. Drink cumin or fennel plus tea one time a week. See recipe in video number 1. 3. Drink enough clean drinking water daily. 4. Eat foods that benefit the health of the kidneys and bladder, such as asparagus, patai, or bitter bean, leafy greens, berries, seeds, and nuts, as well as fatty fish, such as salmon and other seafoods. For strengthening kidneys and bladder, drinking plain black tea help. Drink one mug of tea once a day. Infuse one tea bag or one teaspoonful of tea leaves into a mug of hot, fresh boiled water. Leave to steep for 5 minutes before removing tea bag or straining the leaves out. Tea strengthens also the liver, so if there are signs of constipation, cease drinking tea for a while. Constipation can be corrected by eating fruits such as papaya, cranberries, or drink them as juice, and drink milk, and add cumin or fennel seeds. Avoid eating fruits such as banana during this time. To continue strengthening the kidneys and bladder, drink tea with milk added once constipation is under control. Ensure to drink enough clean drinking water too. So, follow these steps to ensure healthy kidneys and bladders to maintain a good functioning urinary system. Now, let's look again at what to do to upkeep a healthy urinary system. 1. Drinks, spice milk, cumin or fennel plus tea, clean drinking water. 2. Foods, asparagus, bitter beans, berries, leafy greens, seeds and nuts, 
such as sunflower, sesame, almonds, hazelnuts, also fish and other seafoods. 3. Tea for strengthening if needed. Extra note. Eating healthy and balanced is key to a healthy system and body. When body and system are strong and healthy, reproductive system too will be the same. Most of the foods and drinks already mentioned in this and other series help maintain good health for overall system and body. Keep reproduction system clean by practicing douche once a week and take care to keep clean with proper cleaning methods after a visit to the washroom every time. Using some herbal preparations or infusing essential oil into a bottle of water can aid in keeping good, clean hygiene. Add one drop of essential oil of choice into 500 milliliter of water. Wet the toilet paper with the herbal water for a fresh experience. 1. Lemon helps with cleansing. 2. Lavender cleanses and makes better blood flow. 3. Jasmine or Ilang Ilang helps for menstrual cramps. For yeast or light infection on the sexual organs such as itching, use seed oil such as sesame oil, inserting into the vagina or rubbing the oil well onto the penis. Use edible or food quality oil. Use daily until symptoms disappear. Antipathogen oil is also an option, but use only about four times in one week. Recipe and how-to in first video. Practice cleanliness for sexual organ hygiene. To be continued. Remember, if you are allergic to any herbs that was mentioned here, do not take them. If you are still interested to do your detox or natural healing ways, find herbs, spices or flowers with similar properties to the one you need to replace, one that you are not allergic to. Oh, P.S. The dosages given here are for adults. For children under 18, Please lessen doses accordingly, if introducing healthy ways to kiddies. The younger, the littler, the dose.